Hello, welcome back to Blender Switch Live. Today I want to show you a quick and easy way to create this kind of uh, alien monsters uh, fluid jelly uh, using flip fluid simulations inside Blender. So let's get started. First of all, I will need to have the eye, one of the eyeball. Gonna start a new fresh Blender. And this is Blender 2.93. Gonna delete everything, paste the eyeball. So I'm gonna reset the eyeballs positions. This eyeball is actually from one of Blender artists. I forgot the name, but I can give you the link later. So all we need basically just eyeballs, maybe a couple of eyeballs. And we want to have like a UV sphere or icosphere. And we simply want to kind of drop water liquid or like a slime on top of this so that's the basic ideas i can show you how how easy it is so files save as liquid alien so fluid Flip fluid simulations um, is very fast and interactive. So, so I just create a domain. This domain needs to cover our character. And then we need some kind of water surface. The water surface can be in any shape. I think actually just make like a box, like a cube. And we're gonna drop it on top of our object. Maybe this could be like that also. Sphere spherical and apply. Okay, so this is the fluid domain. This is gonna be our obstacles. The eyeballs also become the obstacles. This guy become our water fluid. So let's just quickly bake this. Okay, the size and uh, the fluid seems to be already pretty heavy. And it's colliding with our objects. It seems to seep through our eyeball somehow. I thought that I made this as obstacles. Okay, I need to enable it. Okay, let's uh, let's redo this, or I can actually keep this for now. I quite like this surface. So let's stop this. So here's the plan. Uh, this is our water. This is our. This is gonna be our next obstacles. So currently it's a fluid surface. I'm gonna save this and save as new file. And I'm gonna file, append, go to the desktop and find our alien liquid aliens and bring in the fluid surface object. So append. So this is the bake surface. If we take a look, it's currently it's being locked. So we have our surface. And now we can use that as our new obstacles. So I can reset everything and enable obstacles for the eyeballs and I'm gonna drop the water once again bake it okay this time it's taking taking a while uh, I wonder maybe because I scaled this before file size 1 meters resolution 150 okay Maybe, re maybe the resolution is too high. So 
so I drop another liquid and it it does create a nice surface so it's now it's using the eyeball surface and yeah I can I can live with this a better way perhaps if you want to keep the the eyeballs shapes maybe we, we we have like a cylinder so it's not all the eyeballs got covered or we can wait a few seconds until we have something so we don't want it to be like a water like that maybe let it drop a little bit like that just stop it here so I, I get I'm just gonna save this and I want that fluid surface save as new blend because we want to append another liquid fluid surface open so this is another bake surface and we want to turn it into obstacles we can actually get rid of the old icosphere we don't need that anymore we have the new one we can actually get rid of this as well as ob obstacles the eyeballs we can keep the eyeballs or yeah I think the eyeballs is no longer obstacles either but I'm curious if we have another eyeball here and I want to maybe use like a cylinder and I want to use this to cover the eyes a little bit it's gonna be the new obstacles for the eyes for our fluid Yeah, maybe maybe this will work I don't know just like kind of like a roof uh, let's try this anyway reset the bake bake once again gonna take a while it's gonna calculate this guy as the obstacles it's enabled we have we have other surface already so we might uh... okay we have new new fluid coming coming down with this guy as a fluid with a flip fluid we can actually give it surface material we can give it like a beer material so now we have beer material and now we'll assign a new different color for our beer material and also one more okay starting to get somewhere so this is what I mean uh, with the cylinder covering the eyes now I can stop the simulations we have the eyes not being covered okay so yeah our monster is starting to look pretty good now currently it's a bit slow this is like a fluid simulations and this is pretty heavy surface as well save as new blend we have three level if I really want uh, if we want to try we can actually use flip fluid and there is this options flip fluid world viscosity with viscosity we have something that's more like a jelly instead of like a fluid maybe that's something to try um, 
yeah look look from the bottom the icosphere is actually looking pretty nice um but for now i will just gonna delete everything i will append the fluid surface the latest one so this is the bake three and i will delete everything actually we don't need fluid anymore so the surface is pretty high density if you want to animate this maybe we need to decimate so smooth and decimate 0.2 we still have the fluid surface here maybe you can just delete it command L link copy modifier so I'm decimating the surface assign assign same same thing here so we can animate the character basically and turn it into AR so one two three different surface point two and if we if you use like a sculpt um, you can also sculpt this if you use the sculpt mode you can try and grab and try to sculpt this a little bit more especially around the eyes maybe yeah I'm not really a 3d sculpt a uh, sculptor but if we can just drop this, you know, like a, even like a cloth simulations. So some fluid might be something that we don't need. So we can select this con command L, command I and delete the rest. Just want to keep the surface and delete the rest. Okay, so you got you got the idea. And if you want to animate this, you can select the eyeball, playback, and then you know start animating the eyeballs, looking around, and then let's make this 150 frame. Same deal. Just animating this in real time. One more. If you are not happy, just delete everything. Delete keyframes. Tap R twice and then spacebar. And then you can start recording the eye animations. If you want to make this a little bit nicer, of course, you can you can use join and kind of rig create a simple rig for this jelly and just animate your character right so that's really the basic idea and I think we can definitely make this better I don't know I think with the cloth simulations if we just drop this I haven't test this out but 
cloth filter with gravity if we if we kind of drop it inflate inflate doesn't really work expand I think there is a way so we can use the cloth simulations and it's colliding with the other objects in the scene but yeah just an idea all right so that's basically what it is it's a just a quick experiment with flip fluid uh, I've been meditating with flip fluid for a few days I think this could be an interesting way to create a character like a more like a slimy looking characters um, give this a try yourself um, if you don't have flip fluid you can use manta flow in blender manta flow is free fluid simulations and it should be here somewhere under fluid it's definitely it it could work um, with fluid and then just turn it into flowing objects instead of using smoke try using liquid and then you use the yeah try try manta flow anyway it should generally works uh, it's just not as interactive as flip flip fluid so f this domain this should be a liquid resolutions and you can perhaps turn on viscosity that will work as well the same process hopefully you find this useful thanks again for tuning in and i'll see you next time thank you